Hi everyone. I'm Suwon and this is my girl Tanya. Hi. We're here to share of what God has done in our life. Arthur and I met in City Harvest in 1998. We got married in 2003 and we have three lovely children. Leroy who's our eldest is 17 this year. Regan is 16 and Tanya is 11. They join us for sacred meeting and church services the moment they turn a month old. We are so blessed to be part of City Harvest Church. The babies and toddlers then were well taken care of by Auntie Shirley and her team in the nursery ministry. They were then promoted to the different age group in Harvest Kids. Week after week, the committed teachers ensured that they knew what they were in for. I was never bored in church. There were so many activities that I enjoyed. Week after week, little girl would remind us of the team for church. She would memorize the memory verse and be in tune for the activities planned for her. She takes church and God seriously. She would remember the 66 books of the Bible in order within a week. She would be dressed in red or dressed in team for the week. She would remember Bible memory verse for the week as well. And many times after church lesson, she would perform an act of service to our family members. During the school holidays, Harvest Kids also planned holiday programs for us. I went for my first overnight camp without my parents, did my first floral arrangement, and even baked for the first time. We were also encouraged to reach out to our friends. So, I invited my good friends to church in December 2019 before the COVID-19 hit. I was so excited about it. With COVID-19 pandemic in early 2020, we started to have services online. Little girl would log into Zoom without us reminding her to do so. Many times she would sing out loud and lift up her hands in worship and praise, and sometimes she'll tell us, "Mommy, please open the letter box next week because I've won a prize for being attentive in church." Last year, there was a casting call for hosting at Harvest Kids. So, I signed up for it. And I was selected to teach Psalms 23. I was so happy. And when I shared with the teachers my ambition to be a doctor when I grow up, the teachers gave me another opportunity to interview a real doctor, Dr. Francis, a colorectal surgeon. I even started my research on being a doctor and made my plans for it. Tanya had screened since young. In December 2020, she finally mustered the courage to go for the operation. And we're so grateful and thankful to God for complete healing. Throughout this period, the pastor and teachers of Children's Church have been checking on her and keeping her in their prayers. Earlier this year, I shared with my parents that I have been feeling the stress in primary five. Then I created my own timetable. I remember Psalm 56 verse three says, "Whenever I am afraid, I will trust in you." and that I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. We're thankful to Harvest Kids for laying the strong foundation in their faith and in their life. Thankful for Teacher Paul and Teacher Charlene for making their visits to our house weekly and encouraging Tanya all these years. Our teenage boys are faithfully attending their youth cell group and joining us for online services as well. Thank you teachers and pastors of Harvest Kids for your unwavering commitment to our children. Thank you teachers. I love Harvest Kids. Yay. Hi. <laughs> <laughs>